You know, some people think I play dirty. Well, I say to you, if you've got nothing to hide, then I've got nothing to find. All right, now, where are we at with Denton? He's squeaky clean. He's... He can't be squeaky clean, Dad. Nobody is that clean. Surely he must have, like, a, a sex tape or something like that. You want to see Denton's sex tape? Oh, look, I don't want to see his sex tape, Doug. I just want to know that he has one. Every other candidate has someone like me working for them. The only difference is, I always win. Can someone go get my second mobile phone? I've left it You know how car. we talked about exposing you to an average Australian audience? Well, we've got you on Gladiators tomorrow night. So we've got that happening. Um, so you go and shoot that, and your name's going to be Chamomile on that. Chamomile? Yeah, I'm yeah. going on Gladiators with the name of Chamomile. Yeah, it's tested very well with ABC audiences. So um, Probably my right. biggest win would have to be Lisa McCune in 2000. She hadn't worked in television for over 12 months by that point, and she won the Gold Logie. She literally won the Gold Logie without having done a second's worth of television. <laughs> I mean, we had to step over Don Burke in the process, but that's neither here nor there. So we'll pick you up, we'll go to the hospital, you'll judge the Adam Hills look alike competition. At a hospital? Yeah, sick kids. Um, I'm really not entirely comfortable. Oh, look, the only time I have lost a Logies, Adam, is when a candidate wouldn't listen to what I had to say. Now, I ask you something. Where is Greg Evans today? <laughs> That's all I'm saying. Where's the hospital? All right, so we'll get a car to pick you up. That's at the Alfred. Do I have to touch any of them? No. You know, people say, oh, poor Don Burke. Well, I say to them, he should have hired me.